The big brand sale is now on at OK Furniture and you stand a chance to win big when you save big by any participating brand before the 26th of May 2024 and you could drive away with a brand new Toyota Vitz. There are 15 cars to be won so don't miss out. View our latest catalogue and shop these deals in store or online until the 21st of April 2024. T's and C's apply. It is TV part by World Sports Betting. It is times.co.za. Mamelodi Sundowns go through um, to the semi-final of the NetBank Cup on penalties. Um, I suppose I don't think that there is a goalkeeper in the history of football, or well, clearly in the history of South African football, who's faced um, in the first four months of the year 25 penalties or even more somewhere in that region. It's uh, penalties against Cape Verde, so that's maybe five penalties against Nigeria. That's ten. Uh, penalties against DR Congo, that's 15. Penalties against Young Africans, that's 20. Penalties against Turks, that's 25 at least, give or take. Some of the matches went to sudden death. Some of the matches, maybe the extra penalty, Islan who didn't have to be kicked, maybe because they had already won. But through all of that, there was only one team that came up with a strategy. Sometimes uh, you tell people, just like the clever people who are not ignorant can tell people, whether he saves it or not, it doesn't matter as long as you follow our strategy. This is our strategy. I'm not going to mention that strategy. We've mentioned it long enough. And if the teams are not going to use it, they must go and see what, in that sequential order, penalty one, two, three, four, and five, how did Nigeria take it? There's something that you could do to win additional prize money to get to the semifinals, but clearly these teams uh, couldn't do. Young Africans had no, it had no intention to win a match in the first leg. They dragged it to penalties in the second leg. And it tags clearly, like this was a waste of our time actually. It tags dragged this game into penalties, but here we are. So you dragged it to the penalties to do what? To just take penalties timidly? And no, it's not a lottery. You can plan it. There's planning in football. If any of you read books, you will know that in the UEFA Champions League, they decide penalties through planning. They've stopped making it a lottery. It's not a, it's not a lottery. Everyone knows where they're going to kick, and it's based on the strategy of how the goalkeeper moves. Ronan Williams has too much information. But anyways, um, I'm going to dwell again like I dwelled last week. Mr. Tuenzo, what did you make of the game, sir? Mr. Gilgunjan, yes, sir. I'm going to justice. I'm going to junior. In Bruce and Nemakai, can support in Jalai Tiskitiv in the Belgium Jalak Chick Foot. Twenty five penalties. Mr. Kill, uh, you know, uh, I'm getting worried. <laughs> I'm getting worried for really like uh, 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 Mars. But they're dragging the game Go, to penalties. For, for what good reason? Because, you know, when you do that, it's based on what you've got a plan. Yeah. So you, you've studied to go to K. For, now, Rowan, Mr. K, we, 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 we saw him. Of course. Uh, we saw Guto K. Uh, Rowan, uh, it doesn't stand uh, still. We are tired of our right. I'm not going to be able to what it's it so, does. It's so clear. What it does. You'll uh, go to the right. First time you will go to the right. Second one will go to the right. Unless if if Mangabe uh correct, then that's when he's gonna change and go to the left. But he's not gonna keep um clambe am visipuri the mosos shy with Sayama. It doesn't and, stand. And never, never. Now that's why I'm saying, I'm, I'm getting worried, Mr. Gill, to say, you guys, when you're going to play against Sundowns, you drag the game to penalties. So what's the point? And yes, because <laughs> now, Mr. Gale, in football now, uh, people, they need to learn. Now, it's research, 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 and more research yeah. when you're going to play against a team. Uh, your research about the players individually, your research about the team itself, where do you think it is this team, why they are so strong in sundowns? What is that they doing it right that makes us crack all the time? Oh, they play in the pockets. No, it means... And they did that well, actually, that part of the research. Yes. They actually stifled the sundowns by bambi yes, in, in, in the actual yes. game. Yes. Which means... And if you look at the second half, they yeah. had no plan to score. No. So which means no. they were dragging this game to penalties. And if you, from the second half onwards, yeah. it's mm. 45 minutes yeah. plus 30 minutes plus 15 minutes of, like, penalties. it's a waste. It's a waste. We, okay, we're sitting here watching you dragging it to penalties. And I was so intrigued. I was like, because it's Kabananga anyways. And I was so intrigued. I couldn't care about that uh, argument. I was like, I want to see if 
any of them have finally got what Nigeria got. No. So Nigeria saw them in one penalty shootout and yes. they devised a strategy. But these ones have seen 15 more penalties, but they failed to come up with a strategy. That means uh, either uh, the analysis team or the coach himself didn't do their job. Because uh, you cannot go and play against Sundowns and then... You know, look, they had a good plan. In yeah, the in, in game, yeah. In the Absolutely. game, perfect. Absolutely. Look, they did very well. They frustrated Sundowns. Sundowns couldn't do anything. And the game, especially second half, the game was so boring. In that yeah, it wasn't going of, anywhere. Yes, because those guys, they knew what it is that they wanted to do. And they were doing it right. But now, when you're dragging the game, you're going to the, to, to, to the penalties. Did you also plan for the penalties? So why, why do we have to drag the game to penalties? In, in fact, if, so one thing about penalties um, that I thought was interesting was when they took out U Julis. Yeah. Julis is their best technical team. kicker of the ball. Yeah. And I thought when I saw them taking out U Julis, Uguti, clearly there's a problem. Because why are, are they not thinking, Uguti, this guy is going to take one yeah. of the penalties mm -hmm. for us? Mm -hmm. And when they took him out, they put on Otogo Zanesikotlong, who missed a penalty. Mm -hmm. Uchuli scores free kicks from outside the box. He's very good technically. So I thought, okay, maybe you have a plan, but clearly you don't have a plan even in that, in that moment in extra time when you take out Uchuli. Uh, you know, Mr. Gil, uh, I think our coaches, they need to uh, do more research uh, and know your players. You know, you can't have a good passer of the ball not taking a penalty. It's, 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 it's something, something must be wrong somewhere. Something must be wrong somewhere because, uh, I mean, this person, you know how to pass. So taking it a penalty. All the same pieces. Yeah, so taking a penalty, that, that's not going to be an issue. But now, uh, that's what I'm saying. Or either it's the coach or the analysis team, uh, one of the two. Con problem la. because when you drag a game like this, Mr. Q, already you, you have to think to say, Is I'm taking them to penalties? Do I have players for penalties? Uh, can I trust my keeper in terms of he can save penalties? Okay, for sure. No, I've, I've, I've got players that will take penalties, or others that are here sitting here. Who can I sub so that I can have these two? Same applies to Nigeria, that's what they did in Nigeria. No, they just put. Those two extra there are substitutions in extra time or two penalties. Yes, based on the penalties. So now, I don't know what what, what came to a, a, a Matax coach. Uh, you take out a player that is good in, in technique, uh, is always scoring. And then, yes, it's fine. But now the problem is that you've lost. You've lost your kicker, kicker, which is the reason why you're dragging the whole game to penalties. You wanted to go to penalties. Now, when you want to go to penalties and then you take out a player that you should, you should, was supposed to take a penalty, I don't know. I think we, we uh, this game, I hope maybe other coaches they will learn also to They say, learn nothing. Um, they're I, just I, employees. I think yeah, just, more, many coaches are just, yeah. um, they're charlatans. I think a lot of coaches are glorified employees. They don't read books. They don't... Bruh, there's books about how a certain team won a yes. Champions League. Yes. Good 2015, yes. good 2013, yes. good And you can implement that in game. That's why they call it modern football. What they like to do about football, which I hate, is stupid ignorance. They like to copy each other. But in you know, three coaches, or oh, let's try these three coaches. <laughs> they don't even know where that comes from. Let's talk about Sundown. So they, 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 they really failed um, to break down attacks. Why was that? Uh, you know, Mr. Kiel, when, 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 I'm a tax, they frustrated Sundowns. And Sundowns, uh, again, and there were moments where they were supposed to, you know, increase the pace, change the pace. You can't go again number one all the time. You know, go to two, three, four, five, or even six if uh, your car allows you to go uh, with gear number six. But with sundowns, uh, like Rowan started very slow. The build up they were slow, and I think it allows um, attacks to really mastermind their plan and do it perfectly because Sundowns gave them time. You know, when they started to, to, to build up from the back with Umvara, Kekana, eh, Mukwena, Obas, and then they said, okay, thank you very much, you can do that. You're giving them time to recover. Yes, and look, now when, even when they get to that uh, uh, half uh, Yamataks, it was so difficult 
to get those pockets. Yeah. And they were still trying to pass. So I think one of the other things that I saw in this game yeah. um, is that initially your strategy will always be to try to find that killer yes. pass yes. through the spaces. Yes. But if you've been trying it for 45 minutes and you have a one by Valil, yeah. what, what hurts you from picking up so who is just next to me? It's yeah. not a backward pass, but he's yeah. next to me. And I could move. Like create angles for yourself yes. if you cannot pass it beyond yeah. the player who's standing in front of you. And even Nagudi line, they were doing that. They were looking for this killer pass through those pockets. But there's nothing wrong with also passing it um, laterally to your yes. left or right. Yeah. And Sundowns, the one thing about them that's beautiful is that they always have a man available. Yeah. It's not like there was no availability, but... Yeah. There are men who were behind the defender or next to the defender. They were always marked. So you could, you could change the plan. You could change the plan. That's maybe the question. Uh, you no, know, it was better when this boy came in my pen. Yeah. Then he gave Sundowns a life. And that's one thing that uh, I always say, team like Sundowns, uh, now they need to learn. Uh, or learn to say, I need to balance my game. Because if I'm not going to balance my game, I'll be frustrated like the way my tax they did to peg that midfield, to peg that defense, to say, you're not going to get those pockets. Stretch them. Stretch them. Use the width. Give, give, use the width. Allow those players to take them one, one v one. So that, you know, when you use the width, Mr. Kyo, one thing that I love about this game and when you use the width is that you're going to stretch that, that right back. He's not going to have a partner who's going to cover him. Because when he goes there, this center back needs to be worried to cover uh, his partner here central. So when you get him that side, one v one, so it's easy for uh, 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 to break a defense like that. But now, if you're going to continue here central, then they say, thank you very much. Like uh, what, what, what happened? Yes, one or two passes, they manage to, 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 to put them through. But... They were frustrated because of one thing that they always come straight, come straight. Sometimes you need to balance with, use the width. I mean, we were watching MNC, MNC and, and, and Real, Real, Madrid. Real Madrid. What a game. I mean, you, what a game. You could see that how you stretch your defense. You know, uh, let the, the wingers stay, especially the wingers of, 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 of Man City, they stay right in the line. Yeah. You know why? Yeah. You need to isolate him from his partners. Yeah. Isolate and him. And we um, uh, yeah, Yes. You, you need to isolate him. Because if you come inside, it means now he's got a, he's got a partner now. That if you beat him, then he's got a cover. But if you stay right on the line... It's one v one. It's one v one. Because he can't move and go and cover you there. Because now it's going to be one v one in the space here, in the middle. And you're going to crack yourself. So I think... Um, Urulani, he just need to look at that because especially now he's going to the semi-final of Champions League. So if he's going to continue with this, you know those guys are so stubborn. You know, they will just sit there and then say, now let's see, maybe catch him with the break because now sometimes they get lost in terms of how they organize themselves uh, without a ball. So if you get, like it happens uh, against Yanga where at some point they were caught you know, one v one, three v three, two v two, and you you cannot allow that because anything can happen to the player. Because again, two v two is a way guy, very old, and then just go straight. Because you'll never know in football, so you just need to be careful in that. All right, there you go. Thank you very much, Mr. So and so. And the third game, we the Light Chiefs in the Milford in the city. Uh, Emil Ford, um, it directly came here with penalties and the Chiefs, unfortunately, being like, yeah, but Banga Kor, or Chief of the Robert, but possibly penalty with extra time. They were young and a cool team, waste in and the teams as a strong with competition. And you know, we would see the next, the very next game they're going to yeah. play, they were just going to be knocked out by someone stronger than them. I'm so grateful that we still have. Uh, some of the big teams in the tournament because Lord knows that you guys are not interested when a final has a small team. Uh, Stellenbosch was against what Richards Bay, who uh, calling Blake Label. Yeah, but on the Sunday, the share game, the Paris share game, the share game team is in Golos or whatever. Because the three of the teams, as in the Lingo, they are going to be strong. We are going to be second half. We extra time attacks. I'm going to phone a win. Like I'm going to cancel a lot. But the three of the game, okay, I'm going to be penalty. Okay, I'm like, okay, well done. I'm a strong against the Patent on Sunday. But Patent on next Sunday. By a car, 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 by a car. I understand, like, okay. Clearly, you were not. We're always, you're always not going to win against the Sundowns. You know your strengths. Yeah. 
But then Lendo Leo Saguyo Epena, the Skelly Clash song, the Slan of Sug, the Skelly Clash song, the Safi Capas, the Glint, the Glint, said, Okay, Yen Zaganens, Uta, and Uron, and Uta, let's say, Epena, in Bonil, Benis Bugel videos, I have been as Bugel, not too long on a penalty. So there you are. Thankfully, still one big team is still left in this competition. Lord knows these videos are a waste of time when it's smaller teams. It will just be a fun moment when a big team is, 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 is dismissed or knocked out the Chiefs. But next game, the team they knock out the Chiefs and they and not the line, not the line. So he wasted the band, he wasted the super spot, he SAPC, he the to won't come to the radio. It's like, okay, we have to follow this team. It's with Milford 6 1, it's still like, oh, okay, so the Coupe and JT team and Golden for nothing. Final. So yes, of course, you're not stronger than them, but can you just drag your matches in this week to get a penalty? Never can you pay a next penalty? You can't get a penalty. You can't get a penalty. You can't get a penalty. So anyways, um, well done to Sundowns. Look forward to Pirates as well. Um, navigating past Amazulu tomorrow. Hopefully, they can get to the next round. This tournament needs, needs these big teams. Uh, there's no need to pretend otherwise because you guys don't care when it's anything other than Sundowns, Chiefs or Pirates. Mm. It is good TV, it is good times. We'll Thank you for watching us.